friends, it's Nancy, and I just want to come on today and show you some tiny, tiny treasures that I recently got when I was in um, the Finger Lakes District of New York State on the 50 mile yard sale. I picked up this jar of buttons. Um, I paid a whole dollar. These are the ones that I uh, that I will be sending back to a thrift store. But look how many pearl and bone buttons there are. I cannot believe it. A dollar. And there's some really cool ones. I'll bring that up to show you. Um, this one, it's 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 glass. And it has a, a hole drilled through it. Isn't that fun? This one looks like some kind of a glass bead. It has a hole through the center. Um, here's some pearl buttons with a uh, shank. You can tell that's an antique, can't you? They're all filthy dirty, but that's, that's okay. We can clean those up. I love these little silver ones and there's seven of them and they're heavy I think I might have to save these forever <laughs> This one's a little chewed up, but the other, that one in particular, that one is in good shape. Love those metal ones. And these ones, I, I, I don't keep a lot of vintage buttons, but these ones are so grungy. I mean, I will try to wash some dirt off. This is just a heavy gold one. This one is plastic, but it's got some swirls. And then this little bitty thing. Little cube. So there's some tiny, tiny treasures. Got these all sorted out. Just push that over there. Okay. What else did I get in the in the realm of tiny treasures? I saw a sewing kit, and it just had this. It had a lot of different things in it, but it had this little plastic bottle that had little white safety pins with beads on it. And I thought, oh, those are cute. They're not old, but heck, I can use those for something. Um, I have this little brooch, and it has a Mary on it. And the ribbon of the brooch has little stars. Maybe they're flowers. I thought initially they were stars, but they might be flowers. Made in Italy. Um, this one, it's marked as well. Can't read it. I have to get out my magnifying glass, I guess. And look at her! She has a little diamante there on her necklace and then some little pink ones up in her hair. I found this tiny little rosary. It has a dirty little crucifix there. I think this is so cool. And then this one says Lutheran Sunday School. 
and then these two red cross buttons. Both of them. Let me grab some more stuff. I found another brooch that I got. I paid 50 cents for it. And it's an old one because it has the C clamp, or not the C clamp, the opposite of the C clamp. It's just got a little spring loaded pin there. And I don't know, some kind of cement. I like that. Another bag of buttons. These are all pearl buttons. I paid $2 for this and happy to do so. Um, this little star has tatting, as you can see. That's a pretty little dainty doily. This one, it's got lots of holes in it, but it also has these little pretty embroidered, cross-stitched, um, roses. I like that. This, uh, I did not pay $5 for it. I paid, I think I got five pieces and, and I paid a total of $5. So this is marked as a baby bonnet. I will happily, happily tear that up one snap on it and this is a hanky that had this purple rose I think I will fussy cut around the rose and use it as an applique this is um, a table runner But the netting is so pretty. It's vintage, but it's not antique, and it's um, clean as a whistle. This was an apron. It has a little bit of um, trim on it. There's, I cut the straps off because I won't be using it as an apron. There's a little bit of embroidery there. There was an embroidered pocket, I already tore that off. And then, and then this girl with her appliqued dress in pink. A little primitive, not the best uh, seamstress in the whole world, but can't say that I would have done any better. <laughs> <clears throat> Not clear how I'm going to use that yet, but I don't, I can't remember what I paid for it. I found a box of greeting cards and it just had these four cards in it. Brand new, well, vintage, but not used. Look at this one with the ties. There's a birthday card. And this one flips up. May your birthday wishes come true. Isn't that cute? And then um, just these two envelopes. Oh, no, there's an envelope, but it's all tore up. Might not, these might not be the envelopes that these cards were supposed to go with, but... And last, Doug saw this and he said, go, go over to that lady over there. And there's a, a book that you might like. Paid a dollar for this. Uh, and it has um, all these cool ads in the back. Let's go. 
that way. And then these illustrations. Photographs, yeah. But I do like these illustrations. Sea flowers. I've done some underwater photography here. Love it. That will be torn apart and become some pages in a journal. So those are my tiny treasures that I wanted to share with you. I don't think I have anything exciting. Anyway, take care. I hope you're having a really great day. Your, your week is off to a good start. And we will talk to you again soon. Bye-bye. Mm -hmm.